Hey, how you going? Today I've got the original Otinger. I didn't know there was a duplicate, but apparently this is the original. Let's check it out. You probably guess by looking at this, this is a German beer. It has that classic German sort of style to it. Uh, it's talking about low calories up here. It's got a blank top and nothing else too exciting about this. This is smelling very sweet with a slight little bit of hops in it. Uh, it's probably got a bit more of the honey vibe to it and a touch of malt. It's not bad, it's seemed pretty, pretty promising. How's it look? Well, you can see for yourself a little bit there. It's got probably low to medium carbonization. Didn't get a huge head on it. It's looking a bit more like a lemonade at the moment. Uh, color wise, sort of, yeah, straw color. It's pretty smooth and it's got a bit of bite in it. I know that sounds a bit opposite, but it's not slimy. It's probably got a medium consistency and it's, yeah, it feels pretty good in the mouth. Carbonization, you can probably already gather that there's not a lot bouncing, but it's just a smooth, refreshing taste. And then at the end, it's got a bit of bite on it. It's interesting. Not sure why I've never heard of this beer before. I think this is one of those beers that is severely underrated, or if not underrated, is at least unknown. Because this beer has a lot of flavor in it starts off it's got like a medium body uh, it's got some uh, subtle sort of malt notes to it and then it's got this bitterness at the end it's quite interesting to drink this beer and at the same time say this is non-alcoholic it's just got so much flavor packed into it I'm pretty happy with this find I've never heard of this I hadn't seen anyone raving about it that this was a must-try beer and to me, this is a must try. It's got super strong flavor profile. It's relatively cheap. And as it's a German beer, it's probably pretty widely available. And I mean, I'm having this beer and it's got mm, 25 days until it's expired. And it still tastes to me like a very good beer. That's a good sign. If you can get your hands on this, Otinger, I guess that's how it's pronounced. If it's not, let me know in the comments. Uh, get your hands on it. This is good. This is what Dry Dude's all about. Finding the best non-alcoholic beers and bringing them to you. Subscribe and join me on that journey. See you soon. Bye.